It's time. It's power time. We've got audience reactions, plus we got a story I want to cover. The first story I want to cover deals with a subscriber who hit me up dealing with 2-bit, and I'm going to set his theory up by showing you this. <laughs> I've never known you to play for mistrial. You always play to win. Paula, don't worry. I promise you, we will get the verdict we should. This is the right jury. I know what I'm doing. Besides, I don't know nothing anyway. That's bullshit. You know everything. I'm sorry. Who are you again? You know who I am, nigga. I'm black motherfucking Santa Claus, and I'm about to give you the gift of the century. Ladies, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, this is not my theory. This is my folk Ron's theory. There was a conversation Method Man was having with Paula. It was basically pillow talk. When he was talking about his relatives, he said he, said he had a brother that was doing time. Shout out mm. to my man, Ron. He wants to know, could it be that Meth McClain is 2-Bit's brother, which is why he highlighted, you know me, N-word, and why he told Paula that I got a brother that's locked up. Larry. Could you see mm. that? Could you see that being Meth's brother, Two Bit? Wow, that would be, uh, yeah, that's something else right there. Oh Shout yeah, I don't even know. Family. Hey, well, let's just say that they did make Two Bit. Let's just say they did make Two Bit his brother. How would that play into the story? I'll tell you this from a legal from a legal perspective. Mm -hmm. That works out great for Tasha if if that if two bit turns out to be his his um his brother because if if somehow Tasha does not get out if somehow she gets convicted mm -hmm. and she if turns out it, and it comes out that two bit is is her attorney's brother mm -hmm. her conviction's gonna be her her conviction's gonna be set aside she's gonna get it well I don't know if it'll be set aside but she'll get granted a new trial. Because I think at that point she'll have a legitimate you still have a legitimate appeal to say that she received inadequate counsel that her that her lawyer threw the case because he was working really on behalf of her brother his own brother rather than her and mm -hmm. used the opportunity of her situation to get him out of jail and so mm -hmm. I'm thinking that that it might be great for Tasha because even though Tasha you know. If she gets out, it's great for her either way. Because if she gets, if 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 Meth McClain does a great job and gets her out, she's out. If she if she does if he does a terrible job and she's locked up, she has an appeal that she's likely to win. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. we'll see. Well, you know, like he just like he Paula just said, when have I ever known you to be playing for a mistrial? And he's he's looked like he's going for the mistrial, Larry. Like he's still going to get that'll get Tasha out, and he's. He seemed like he's cool with it. So it would be very, very, very interesting if they pulled that out. But I would Here's just, you know, yeah, go for it. Remember when the judge was, remember when they had that meeting in the chambers, when they had meetings in chambers with, with Sachs and, and Meth McClain, and there was, uh, and they brought in. Um, Rodriguez. They brought in, yeah. And. And the judge was very, very close to throwing this thing out, saying, telling Sachs, look, this is all too messy. You've got your hands in all kinds of weird places. And, and he convinced the judge to let the case go, go forward. But she was very close to throwing it out. And mm -hmm. I think if he can, I think if Meth McClain can get a mistrial, that the court is not going to hear this case again. They're going to simply say no to the federal government. No, you guys F this up colossally. There's no way in hell we're going to hear this case again. It's done. She's done. You're out. Don't touch her again. And mm. I think that's where it'll go. Okay. So I could see why he would want a mistrial because I think it. I think it would be best for his client. At I mean, the best thing would be an acquittal. But if the next best thing would be, would be a, a you know a mistrial because I don't think the I don't think the the courts will hear it again. Okay, I can roll with that. Um, I guess, ladies and gentlemen, we'll see. Shout out to my subscriber for that theory.